four brand new maps. Cove, Detour, Rush, Outblank, and a brand new zombies experience that we call Buried, featuring the reimagining of a fan favorite, the Ray Gun Mark II. Cove is this rocky outpost island in the Indian Ocean. You're surrounded on all sides by water, and you're weaving and bobbing your way through these outcroppings of rock, overgrown with beautiful foliage. And as a player, you're trying to force the enemy team, pushing them into the center, where they're going to have to face off against multiple lanes of fire. So players that are really keen on using the terrain and rocks to their advantage are going to be able to flank and master the map and really surprise enemies from behind and the side. It's going to be a lot of fun. Detour is one of my favorite head-to-head -head map collisions. You've got multi-levels of this bridge, so while players are colliding on top, the battle is facing off underneath all of them. This map offers a variety of engagements. You can be on the top of the bridge where there's medium, long, and short range. Underneath, it's more short, it's quick flanks, maybe take a shotgun or SMG. Players will create their battle lines, protect their side of the bridge, and the team that can do that successfully is the team that will win Detour. Rush is going to take you to a paintball arena. What's paintball like in the Call of Duty universe? Well, that's Rush. There are all sorts of different environments for playing paintball, and Rush supports multiple of those environments. I love the speedball area. Move forward, use the bags. They're all different shapes. You can use them to your advantage. It's really interesting to fight in and around them. Rush is all about fast-paced action. The name is no lie. This map is all about running forward. Don't look back. You've got to press forward. Uplink is a satellite control facility in Myanmar. If you know Summit from Black Ops, then you know Uplink. So let's bring it back, but give it a little twist, give it a little spice. There's a lot of good chokes. Everyone wants to hold down the main facility, and that's where you're going to hold it. That's where you're going to have a lot of battles. And then if players want to branch off from there and kind of flank and be smart, they have the opportunity to get in those longer range, medium or short engagements, depending on how they want to play the map. You will stay forever. Buried is our new zombies map. This is something we've never done before. We've taken that little old west town and shoved it underground. Our four characters are back, and they have a lot more information to give the players as far as the story goes. Fans are going to be very excited about one of our new characters. It's really up to the players to find out whether or not this is something they're going to have to fight or how they can utilize them to their benefit. We're going to bring the fans the Raygun Mark II. This is an evolution of the fan favorite, the Raygun. It is a true laser gun. It is going to go through entire trains of zombies. Vengeance addresses the community desire to have head-to-head, -head, super controlled gameplay. It's pushing you, and the players who have the skill are the ones who are going to come out on top of those battles. We're coming back with a Vengeance on July 2nd, first on Xbox Live. Hey, what's up everybody? XX Tusk here bringing you another video. Well, not video. This was the Black Ops 2 DLC 3 trailer. And it does look absolutely amazing. Leave in the comment section down below what you think and your thoughts and opinions on this trailer and what you think is going to be coming new to Zombies and the, what about the, the Raygun Mark II and all the four new multiplayer maps. So le um, Also, like, comment, favorite, and subscribe to my channel already if you haven't already. Peace.